Hi, so we'll be looking into the next topic which is about the aircraft data loading. So how actually the data are loaded. So to install or to update the data in the uh, flight management system, we use PDL, okay, portable data loader. Now, the requirement of the PDL is similar to the requirement of ARINC 615 data loader. ARINC 615 data loader use ARINC 6 to 9 data bus for uploading and downloading data to and from any avionics device. So you need to remember all this, you know, ARINC number. Now, look-wise, how it look? It has got LCD display. It has got four push buttons uh, for self-test and for disk directory information. It has got three LED annunciators, one for power and two for the status of PDL, whether it is ready, whether it is it has failed. Then you can insert the CD, DVD, ROM or the floppy disk and both high density and low density floppy disk can be used with uh, this. We also use MSD. MSD stands for mass storage device and if we use MSD the advantage is we don't need to you know change the disk and we don't need to unnecessarily monitor the disk so that is the advantage of using MSD mass storage device and we use two cables one for high speed and other for low speed transfer for high speed transfer we use ARINC 615 cable and for low speed transfer we use ARINC 603 cable it has got two independent transmitter and uh, four independent receiver and uh, out of this uh, two independent uh, transmitter they use ARINC 429 data bus and each of them is capable for low speed Oper uh, transfer as well as for high speed transfer if it is low speed transfer in that case the speed is 12.5 kbps and if it is high speed transfer in that case the speed is 100 kbps okay and that's all you need to know about the data loading aircraft data loading okay bye bye